Okay, back to the park. I really like these water edges. Got quite a bit of gold out of here this year. Yeah, Halloween night, nothing to do. A couple hours till dark, Let's see if we can get some gold. Okay, so I kind of just pull them as quick as I can because, you know, it's just a numbers game. But AT Max, 60, 61, 59, it's pretty solid. I mean, it's more than likely a pull tab, but could be gold. Let's check it out. Yep, pull tab. Foil. So keep taking the foil, guys. This is uh, where some of the smaller gold is, like thin women's uh, 10K. I'm in Montana, so I get a lot of uh, Black Hills gold, 10 carat, small rings in the foil range. I don't usually get as many bottle caps, but these rusty ones tend to come up just like a pull tab. I don't usually get as many bottle caps, but these rusty ones tend to come up just like a pull tab. Well, I got this penny in a hole with the <laughs> bottle cap, but for some reason it sounds like pull tabs. All right, you still with me? I mean, if you've already given up, that's why you're not getting gold. I dig hundreds of pull tabs, but I get the gold. This is 45, 46, AT Pro. Let's dig it. Let's see what it is. Now, this is probably either going to be foil, a piece of a pull tab. Or a small ring. But it's a little more solid than, you know, the foil sounds normally are. They're usually a little scratchy. Let's see what we got. Feels like foil. Yeah, so this one was a little more solid because it was in kind of a chunk. Hey, first nickel. Builder. Okay. This is an 80, solid 83. I'm suspicious that this might be a silver ring. Because it's a little higher than a dime. Like we just live dug ourselves a silver dime. 1964. Just made it. It's just a baby. But we got silver. Okay, this is a really loud 4748. Super solid. That should be foil. But I'm gonna live dig this just in case it's a gold ring. Some sort of fancy trash, what does it say? Yeah, I don't know. T 
repair, I think. Okay, right at dark, I heard a really deep. You can see how deep this hole is. Silver signal, and I dug down, it looks like it's a weedy. So, oh yeah, there it is, one cent. Okay, here's the wrap up. So this is what a gold hunter's pile should look like. See how I've mostly dug pull tabs? And very little clad. But, because I do know my silver signals really well, I was able to still snag a silver dime and a weedy. So, no gold this time, but that's kind of how it rolls. I usually only get gold about every other night or every third night. So, subscribe and you'll be able to see you in my next hunt. Hopefully, uh, I'll get gold next time.